Then we got three mid entree. One short rib. When did you make the transition between being an awesome chef and being an educator? 50% of the industry do the street smarts, you know, work your way through and it's brilliant because it is a, it's a craft. 50% go to school. You have to be careful who you train on. And if you grow too fast, you know, you're not going to learn from other people's mistakes, which is life, right? You learn from other people. You learn what they do well and you learn what they do poorly. You can teach someone with a recipe, but if you're chained to that recipe, then you're just going to be a cook for your whole life. But if you understand the science behind it, if you understand what's going on with the food, then that's when you can become a chef. You have these restaurants and they have the executive chef and all of a sudden just leaves the line. He's more fascinated by paperwork and ordering and systems and tools. It actually means nothing. You're the chef of that restaurant, your name's on the door, be in the restaurant.